mysterious and thrilling world of Secrets of Sulphur Springs has brought us on incredible journeys. And in season three, we are in for a whole new adventure. As the third season unfolds, we can't help but wonder what season four will bring us. Will there be new mysteries? Will Griffin and Harper be able to uncover the whole truth? Let's find out. It's been a long time before Disney got to renew the show for a third season. But since they have, viewers remained hopeful that the show will go on and move past season three, eventually releasing season four and maybe even five. Well, that's far ahead of us. But since the third season has just been released on March 24th, we believe that it won't be long after season three concludes that we'll hear more about the release date of the fourth season. Since the first season was released on Disney, the show instantly became a huge hit, and Disney quickly saw the potential it had and moved forward with renewing the show for another season. Both seasons have been a huge success for Disney, and it'd be a shame to drop this series just now. For a while, it wasn't sure whether or not Disney would decide to move forward with it, but in February 2022, two weeks before the season two finale, Disney officially announced that the show would be returning for a third season. Well, since it was confirmed, Disney took their sweet time before announcing an official release date. Both seasons one and two debuted in January, with the first season arriving in 2021, followed by season two in 2022. The third season stepped away from this pattern, being released in March instead of January, but each of the seasons came one year after the previous one. With that being said, the potential season four may be released in 2024, or about a year from now. We still have a few unanswered questions, but if the third season is as big of a hit as the previous two, that would mean that Disney would see the extreme potential of the show and renew it before we know it. As of today, season four has not been confirmed, but if everything goes according to plan with season three, we might be looking at March 2024 release dates for the fourth season. Still, there's a long time ahead of us before this season gets confirmed, but we believe more will be made official shortly after the season three finale. The show follows 12-year-old Griffin Campbell, whose world has been turned upside down by his father after he moves the family from Chicago to take ownership of an abandoned hotel property, the Tremont. Alongside his mother and his younger twin siblings, Griffin and his family live in the Tremont in hopes of restoring it to be the lively vacation destination it once was. Throughout the seasons, the entire story of the show has been revolving around the Campbell family, and going into season four, we can't imagine having a season without one of them. All of the family members are set to smash that like button if you haven't done so already. <laughs> Oh no, they're set to return for the upcoming season, including the titular character Griffin, who's been portrayed by Preston Oliver. Throughout the seasons, we've learned that the hotel has been haunted by a ghost, and Griffin goes on a mission to figure out the truth. Griffin meets Harper, played by Kylie Curran, who further helps him to discover all of the secrets the hotel holds. One of the major characters in the show has also been Savannah, who is the ghost haunting the hotel. Savannah, portrayed by Elle Graham, is a girl who disappeared decades ago and is believed to be stuck as a ghost. If you haven't seen the show by now, you're missing a great drama mystery show. Apart from the obvious cast members that are set to return, we might even be seeing some brand new faces. However, Disney hasn't announced anyone yet. Our best guess is that they are keeping the new edition a secret and have them revealed throughout the season. Depending on the adventure that Griffin will take us on this time around, we might be uncovering more and more secrets about people we didn't even know existed. Season two was a roller coaster ride of suspense, intrigue, and supernatural forces that kept viewers on the edge of their seats. In this season, we follow Griffin and Harper as they return to the haunted town for another summer of adventure. This season picked up right where season one left off, with Griffin and Harper investigating the mysterious disappearance of Savannah. As the season was slowly reaching an end, the tension and stakes continued to rise. Griffin and Harper found themselves in increasingly dangerous situations, with the fate of the entire town hanging in the balance. The forces they're up against are powerful and unpredictable, and they must smash that subscribe button and ring the notification bell. <laughs> oh goodness, no, in all seriousness, they must use their wits and skills to survive. 
The season finale was a heart-pumping showdown between Griffin, Harper, and the dangerous forces that threatened the town, ending on a massive cliffhanger, with Griffin stuck in the future, Savannah stuck in the present, and Harper stuck in another precarious situation. Well, season three began just as explosive as season two ended, with a new ghost from 1947 checking into room 205 and starting to cause chaos around the Tremont. The children quickly learned that their lives may be over by this evil spirit in 2024. So as soon as they are aware of this danger, Dunn and Campbell set out to unravel a complicated riddle from the past that could possibly help them defeat the spirit and save their families from a grim future. As Griffin is stranded in the future, it is more challenging for Savannah and Harper to bring him back to the present. All throughout the season, the kids are all searching for a way to bring back Griffin, while also looking for a possibility to solve the mystery around the evil spirit in Room 205 and prevent it from causing mayhem on them and their families in the future. As this season moves to an end, more and more problems arise, but the kids are there to put an end to it all. Long before season three aired, it was known that it would involve time travel as usual, as Griffin was stuck in the year 2024. However, before the season premiered, we learned that a new ghost would be joining the Tremont and will be more dangerous than anything we've seen before on the show. Well, it appeared to be just right. By the end of season three, we got to see the kids go to the Tremont to search for a way to stop the ghost of Judge Walker. They find Sarah being taken to a hospital, and they are locked inside the hotel, searching for a way to escape the ghost. As Ruby confronts the ghost of room 205, he ends up threatening the kids. However, when the kids find themselves stuck in a room with the ghost, they manage to convince him to leave the hotel and their families. In the meantime, Sarah wakes up from her mysterious coma and tells Ben and Jess that the kids are safe. The season ends with yet another cliffhanger where Griffin and Harper travel to 2024 and share their first kiss as Nick, their future son, appears, warning them not to destroy the radio. This may be one of the best seasons of the show, with new ghosts and new secrets revealed in the mysterious town, and with yet another cliffhanger on the horizon. We bet Disney will move forward with another season and give us all the answers we've been searching for. Each season so far has a new threat coming to haunt the Tremont, and season four will be no different. A new threat will likely come knocking on their doors, but could it be the most dangerous one yet? Sadly, everything that may occur in the future has been kept a secret, and we have yet to see what season four will unfold. All we can be sure of is that it will be just as suspenseful and thrilling as the previous seasons have been filled with potentially new ghosts and a lot of time travel that will allow Griffin and Harper to uncover more hidden secrets, and maybe they'll even discover why the radio shouldn't be destroyed. You'll love this video next!